How did you turn it around in the fifth set? Because you seem to have the upper hand. Well, good. Uh, well, I don't know. It was a little bit of miracle. Uh, I was destroyed, honestly, physically. On the 25th of January 2022, Rafael Nadal played one of the greatest matches in his career. And not because he played well or because the match was of the highest quality, but because he battled through heat stroke and severe dehydration, dealt with stomach cramps marathon, fighting in the scorching 35 degree Melbourne heat. Rafa's extraordinary resilience and willingness to fight till the end, even when facing defeat at the beginning of the fifth set, was something that simply has to be seen to be believed. I started to feel bad, honestly, at the end of the second. Uh, it was very warm out there today. Uh, yeah, and the conditions were hard. Uh, Excellent hold. Chris Shapovalov's girlfriend. Brilliant. Two hours and 53 minutes into this match, we've got a completely different situation now. Which foot is it that Rafa's had a problem with? Do you know? Left foot with his racket yeah. across. Who knows? Maybe he's struggling with that. Maybe it's just physical. There's clearly been a bit of an issue. Building. Take nothing away from Shepard. Uh, I started to feel not very well uh, in my stomach, so I just asked if they can do uh, some. Some pretty desperate times for the 20 time major champion. It doesn't look to me like it's affecting the speed of his serve, so that would indicate it might just be a stomach upset here. He's not the same player he was an hour ago. No, no, it's hot down there um, and it's, it's wearing. From Rafa's point of view, Potentially, this is going to go to a fifth if he is struggling physically. I'm not saying uh, Raf has lost it this yet, but it looks like it. Sent to a fifth and deciding set. He's allowed and then... Well, it's going to be a bad way. An optical oh, illusion. Not. Serving to throwing in those two doubles. Oh, I mean, just look at Shapovalov there. I mean, he moved. Oh, he's mopped. They're down the line here with great reflexes and anticipation. in this situation, no matter how much he's hurting. Oh, look at him. 
He doesn't often do that. The depths of despair in the opening game of the fifth. That was Rafa's movement on that ball, guys. The emotional roller coaster his fans are on. Those moments. <laughs> Nadal gets a helping hand. Yes, thank you. We witness the depths of his desire and competitive will to find a way to win a match. All situations. Oh, yes, the half volley. He should have beat that guy. What after it? What a performance that was on serve, Brad, as well, from Rafa, one of his finest of the match. Was a miracle. He proved again what a great champion he is. It. How did you turn this around and finish this match up? I was completely destroyed after that. I think I was lucky that I was serving great in the fifth. <laughs> okay. <laughs>